Good afternoon and welcome to Nora's Dog Training Company. We're here this afternoon with Fred and Apollo. What we're going to be demonstrating for you today on video is Apollo's ability to understand and respond to his obedience commands, the corrections and the motivation that we give the dogs when we're working with them, and the training equipment that we're using. Fred is using a regular six-foot web training leash and he keeps the bulk of that leash folded neatly in his right hand. That leaves the left hand free to give the correction. And the only correction that we give here at school is a little tug and release on the training collar. Apollo has been fitted with his own training collar and he'll be bringing that home with him. You'll be instructed on how to use that during your follow-up training session. Apollo is sitting very nicely at Fred's left, which is where all of our obedience training is done. And the first exercise that we're going to demonstrate for you is healing. The command is Apollo heal, and at this point his job is to stay even with Fred's left leg. Not forging ahead or lagging behind, walking at his trainer's pace, and if you notice, each time that Fred stops his feet, Apollo has been taught to sit automatically without being told to wait for his next command. So this exercise is designed to make walking your dog a pleasure. He's also been worked around other dogs and he has learned to ignore them. We're not expecting him to be friendly, we're just expecting him to not pay attention. The next exercise that they're going to demonstrate for you is the stay. The stay is a hand and a voice command. Fred uses the open flat of his, of his left palm about an inch or so from the dog's muzzle and the one word firm command to stay. The long sit stay in basic obedience training is for one minute working up to three minutes and this is a great exercise to practice for self-control right in your home. When Fred returns back to his dog, he will walk all the way back around him, returning all the way back around to heel position again, where Apollo's shoulders are even with Fred's left leg. At this point, Apollo expects to get another command, and they're running through their heel, their automatic sit, and their stay again for us. So now when you stop to cross the street or stop to talk to a neighbor, Apollo sitting nicely and waiting for his next command. Fred leaves him in another stay and again. Remember to practice these exercises indoors as well as outdoors. The next exercise that we're going to demonstrate for you is the recall or the come on command. The command is Apollo come. He comes right in front and sits and that eliminates all that jumping all over you and then Fred's going to ask him to return back to heel position. So he walks all the way around Fred back to where his shoulders are even with Fred's left leg and he sits again. Fred leaves him in another sit stay and we're going to demonstrate the come on command again. Fred calls him right in. He comes right in nicely and sits. Very good boy. And you can give him a little pat for praise at that point at home because we want coming to you to always be a happy command. Very good job. Now the next exercises that we're going to demonstrate for you are the down commands. And we have two of them. We have down from a heel position and down from a distance. The first one that we're going to be demonstrating for you is down from a heel position. So with the dog's shoulders, even with your left leg and the dog in a sitting position, Fred will use the open flat of his palm straight down toward the ground and the one word firm command to down. And then he leaves him in a stay and the long down stay when you're practicing at home is for three minutes working up to five minutes. And this is a great exercise to practice while you're having dinner, sitting around chatting, the long down stay is great to use in the house, again for developing attention span and maturity. When Fred returns back to his dog, he walks all the way back around him just as he did on the sit stay, returning all the way back around to heel position and he's going to heal him out of that exercise. And you're going to get a chance to practice all of these exercises with your trainer when you pick him up, Fred's going to leave him in a sit-stay. This is your down from a distance. 
He walks out through the end of his training leash. This is the only time that Fred's going to use his right hand to give the command. Now he didn't go right away, so Fred said no, and he repeated the command, so it's no down. And he went right down for him. He calls him out of that exercise and has him sit. So we know that we've showed you the heel, the automatic sit, the stay, the down, the down from a distance, and the come. We know that you're going to have a ton of questions when Apollo is picked up. And we will, we're prepared to spend time with you, answer any questions that you might have. You will also get hands-on practice working with Apollo so you know how to get him to respond well to you. He has done a great job and thank you for using Nora's Dog Training Company as your personal dog trainer.